Hello, nice to have you on another edition of Roadmap. Just in case you're watching this program for the first time, Roadmap is a 30-minute weekly program where we show you how the JKF-led administration is keeping faith with the people of Ekiti, the land of honor. Remember, the JKF administration is reclaiming the trust and delivering the promise. For anyone and everyone who calls Ekiti home, this is the program to watch. Roadmap. Delivering the promise.
democracy that is truly people oriented. The Dr. John Caldify administration has more than delivered. In the implementation of his administration's eight-point agenda, a lot of ground has been covered. Running of a participatory and all-inclusive government, infrastructure development for the good of our people, 
modernizing agriculture to create jobs for the teeming youths in the state. A positive turnaround of our education sector. Free and qualitative health care for children, the physically challenged, pregnant women and the aged. Resuscitation of moribund industry for the economic revival of our state. Development of our tourist centers to international standard. Gender equality and empowerment under which our elderly receive monthly allowances. This is truly the era of sea and feel. There is no doubt JKF is piloting equity to a new level. Our leader, you continue to draw the line between selfless service and selfish leadership. Ilufemiloye, Ekiti, will never forget your legacy. JKF, the vision continues. Roadmap, delivering the promise. Roadmap delivering the promise. Roadmap delivering the promise. Roadmap delivering the promise.
delivering their promise. Roadmap delivering their promise. To ensure better life in terms of employment generation and creation, in terms of provision of electricity, in terms of mobilization of our people for high productivity, particularly in food production and other forms of agriculture. Meaning, ensuring adequate security. Generally, ensuring that there's freedom and better life for our people. That is the change that APC promises. Particularly, uh, identify some of the provisions for women. For example, the increase in the number of uh, women in leadership positions, whether in the legislative assembly or at the party hierarchy itself. That is a good way, uh, development from what it was in the other party. And apart from that, there is every encouragement for women to, to participate actively, whether in politics, in agriculture, in education. There is special provision for the girl child in the, in, the, in, the, in, the, in the manifesto of the APC. So we are hoping that all these uh, provisions will be actually um, executed to the letter. After 14 years of democracy, 
when we chase the military back to the barracks, what do we have to show for democratic dividends? There must be a systemic change, and this is what the fusion of ACN, CPC, and, NBC, and AMPP means. We've, we've done the stock taking out. Nigerians are asking, is this all we can get for democracy? And we have come together to say, no, democracy can indeed deliver much more. And we reckon that in an attempt to ensure that the local democracy delivers much more, it must be a systemic thing. It goes beyond providing roads, providing pockets of development here and there. Development must be regional. And then people have come together to say, okay, I have strength in the southwest, I have strength in the northeast, I have strength in the south-south, and all of those places. And we felt that let us put our resources together. Let us put our endowments together so that we can overcome our collective challenges. As Dr. Kaya Defiemi is already transforming Ekiti to a new level. You can see that the roads are being built, water is being provided, there is a social security system, there is a youth empowerment system, there is commercial agriculture for the youth. These are some of those things that we will spread around the whole of Nigeria so that everybody can benefit. So it's a great passing and we are very happy. Roadmap delivering their promise. We have by commission this way to the glory of Almighty God and the benefit of our people. Roadmap delivering their promise. What else can we say? You just saw glimpses of the changing faces of Egypt State. You've been watching Roadmap showcasing the GKF led administration's achievements. Well, remember, we welcome your comments and reactions, positive or negative. Send us your SMS on 0816728-4947 and 080-230-72779 or email us on roadmaponTV at agitistate.gov.ng That's roadmaponTV at agitistate.gov.ng Now, if you care to know more about what the JKF administration is doing on the state, log on to the state's official website on www.agitistate.gov.ng You can visit the state's Facebook page through www.facebook.com forward slash State. You can also view videos of all we are doing on YouTube by visiting www.youtube.com forward slash NGR. That's roadmap for this weekend. Thanks for staying with us. To all the good people of Ekiti, please do keep faith with the JKF administration as it continues to transform the state through the eight-point agenda. Rest assured that the JKF administration will continue to deliver their promise. Remember, for anyone and everyone who calls Ekiti home, Roadmap is for you. Till next week, just keep faith. Yeah.